Hello everyone, welcome to Raw Sims, it's me Rawls, oh my goodness, and I'm spinning the camera around too much. And this is part 6 of the Wallace Wood household. So, last time, Aiden and Emma had a little bit of a party, you know, for the holidays, for their family, except the AG didn't bring her wife or child, but hey, what can you do? So, Emma is off at work as a best girl. And, uh, Aiden, despite his intense sloppiness, is going to have to clean this house, because that is a mess. And let's, uh, let's put this away, by which I mean sell it. <laughs> and, uh, let's put their little thing. What just happened? What the heck? That was weird, but okay. Sectionals. Anyway, we're gonna do that, and we're going to also turn down Aiden's uh, music here, because that, that that's, seems it's actually already on low. Oh my god. Okay, you don't need any music right now. So, and why are you stuck there? Move. Aiden is pretending to be a statue, apparently. That's the thing. Lydell. Who is Lydell? But apparently they learned that Karina has a partner. Emma earns $16 at work somehow. No, because she is randomly leaving. Go back to work, girl. Why are you just leaving work in the middle of the day? You've been at work for two hours and you're already leaving. And Aiden is still, like, he hates cleaning so much that he has just decided that he will just be stuck here forever because I asked him to clean. So we're going to reset him because that's not right. And then I guess he will have to go redo do his uh, his singogram. And I guess we will leave the mess for the maid. So go perform your job, my dear. My dear boy who apparently hates cleaning that much. Oh, I forgot I changed. You have your little performance outfit that I gave you on instead of your singogram thingy, but that's fine. You are not Lily, the dog. Uh, so we are having shenanigans. There we go. That's better. Who is this? Why do they need a singogram? Oh my god, it is always these people at this freaking fire station. I mean, firefighters, they deserve our applause and everything, but come on. Every day of your life, you're just getting singogram after singogram. What is up with you? Because like, it's been her like twice. Oh, now it's this lady. What is up with you firefighter ladies? Do you all like have a thing for Aiden? Oh my goodness. Oh. I love it. How did he even get credit for that? Here, you perform her that single rim correctly. How did he get credit for that? I do not know. He just fell on his butt. Try again, honey. There you go. Much better. Do you have any gigs? No, you don't. You must. Yeah, you already did your your one gig that you had. So we should go get you another one. Let's see. Oh, I see Adria is home with her, her child instead of going to parties without said child. So we're going to go over to West Point Park and get another another little gig happening. You are miserable. <laughs> Eat some lunch, woman. And you are miserable also, Milo, my dear, my sweet baby. Go eat. What's wrong with you? You're also hungry. Well, you can wait until after he, he eats, and then you can eat. So we're going to go take uh, Red Delicious over here to uh, get a, another flipping job, or whatever you call the, the thing. What do you call it? A uh, show. So a gig. Yeah, that's what it is. That's the one. If this lady ever gets off the friggin' phone, that is. Come on, lady. Give us another gig. 
Wibs o finchy, wibs o finchy a boo. Yes! Alkin. Give us another gig! <laughs> yes! You get to perform again. You're disgusted by spoiled food. Why are you carrying around this salad? Um, because when I reset you, you for some reason were like, Yeah, you know, I am. keep the salad. There's no one in this park. There's somebody walking by. I want him to go somewhere and perform for tips. Where might actual humans be? I'm just kidding. This is a Sims 3. Who the heck knows where any humans ever are? Let's go audition over here. Brew ha ha. Brew ha ha. <laughs> Come on. There we go. How are you? Have you still not eaten lunch? Eat lunch, woman! There you go. I knew you could do it. And you could take care of yourself vaguely as though you were an adult. And there's our maid who was a jerk to Aiden. But whatever. I didn't watch, but he was just doing the same thing. Did we get it? Did we get it? Did we get it? What? Ugh, excuse you. I'm not up to the standards of your flipping completely empty karaoke place. Whatever, or coffee house, whatever the heck this place is. Film interview at Huber Associates and Kim Gould's Steakhouse. Sure. Do it. It'll be great. Um, and you're going to play some pool. I would perform for tips here just to prove that I'm good enough for your clientele. But you, Brooke Neves, don't have any clientele. So there's no point whatsoever. Oh, there's a little roller rink. That's cute. There's nobody there, but, you know, the, the thought is, is nice. Hmm... Where might he go? The only place anybody ever seems to be is at the fire department. <laughs> oh, maybe the health club. Let's go to the health club and perform for tips and see if anyone shows up to care. You are still, yeah, okay, you're good. You're going to walk to the health club? I mean, I guess it's right over there. I suppose there's a lady running down the street in a weird outfit. Does this one open? Oh, now she's earned 109 whole dollars. Oh, she's been promoted to a key, a grip. Oh, look at this place. It's very nice. Again, there's no one here, but we don't care. Where are you going? Don't watch TV. None of that. Let's go singer and perform for tips. Or not. I clicked that and nothing happened or I didn't click it there we go perform for tips my sweet perform for tips maybe someone will show up and go oh there's a lady maybe she'll give you some tips maybe we can only hope she's just kind of standing there apparently she's pretty drunk or at least thinking well, about being drunk maybe quip, tag whip, see the perform your one song you know my dear and we will back away because it's super duper loud. Oh, Adrian Farr seems to at least be watching. So there's that. Let's hurry it up. See if she gives us any actual money. Oh, there's a second person over there. Playing us no attention, but at least they are present. Let's see. Is she coming over to watch? No, she's just leaving. She's just like, no. She's apparently a repair person, and she has absconded. <laughs> well, play or sing again. Oh, you're singing now. Uh-oh, she likes that. She wasn't feeling the sort of strummy, you know, strummy singing thing, but uh, she, she likes the, the croon in there. And he's finished. She did well in her thingy. He's leaving. Here comes Gwen Welsh. He's for 
coming for tips. Who are you trying to get to now? If it's someone from the dating site, that would be nice. We're going to leave him to do that. We're going to take care of our little Miss Emma. Emma, Emma, Emma. She needs to go on the dating site too, even though I've mostly given up. I actually just need to make them some people to, to romance. Frankly, because the game is not providing as these things go. Oh, puppies down here to greet her. Milo. Oops. That's my phone. Sorry. I got to put that on vibrate. Alright. There we go. You're home. You're stressed. We're trying to be stressed for like 14 more minutes. So who really cares? Hey, I'm Miss Missy. Go and do... Go create a profile. Go do that. That's a thing to do. Maybe there'll magically be someone interesting for you. Those are has never been before for anyone else. Oh, he got promoted. Yeah, he's the most popular singer Graham deliverer. Yeah, we're not gonna lie. You now have a few songs for singer grams. Keep at it. Make your lucky break. Good, 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 my boy. Good, good, good. Oh, here's a guy for you to get to know. Stop performing. And get to know man. Are they dancing? Oh, they're dancing to the music in here. No, don't don't take a call. Ignore call. Go find this guy wherever he is. So apparently he's gone. He is gone. He is it's out of here. He no longer exists. Who is this? That is quite the hat, Maximus. Let's talk to Maximus. Let's see what his deal is. He's very thin. You're kind of a weirdo, Maximus. See if you like a good joke. Aiden enjoys a good joke. Announce your promotion. Apparently Maximus does indeed enjoy a joke. Announce your permission. These about dogs. You're very kind, Maximus. That's very excited to be about. Who has fleas? Is that you? Adrian, you need to get that checked out, lady. Do not get in that pool. Oh my god, she's getting in the pool. Oh my god. Hopefully the chlorine will kill the fleas. That is gross, lady. That is. Um, let's just ask him a couple more questions. Ask his sign. Uh, get to know him a little bit. Why don't we invite him over to our house? A much better place for such things. Wait, why can't I? No? Friendly? Here we go, invite over. All right, let's see if that goes well. She's reading a book. But what we're actually going to do is we're going to check the profiles on this thing. I doubt you have any messages yet, my sweet. So we're just going to browse a couple of profiles. Looking for love, looking for love. What are you doing down here, Lily? You don't even know. You're lucky you're cute. You want to guard the home. Aw, how sweet. How are you doing? Oh, friends now. You should be happy to come over then with his little weird hat on. Alright, and let's see who's here. And um, Brant. Brant is athletic. A daredevil. He's good. He's a loner and he's a mooch. Pass Grant. Ariel, he is clumsy, a daredevil, a good sense of humor, he's a schmoozer, he's a technical, it's a little bit weird. Uh, Lionel has a really weird hat on, he is disciplined, a good sense of humor, a natural cook, a party animal, and a technophobe. Alton, who are you? 
do I remember you from something? Anyway, he is absent-minded, artistic, a couch potato, a party animal, and a perfectionist. Here's Arnolfo, married, always on here anyway. Nelson, with terrible hair, is athletic, bookworm, good sense of humor, hydrophobic, loves the outdoors. Here is a green person. That's a little bit too weird for me, buddy. You're green. I'm not feeling that. And you're not, you're just not attractive. You look very angry about the world and everything in it. What is happening with your nose, buddy? What is happening? And, eh. Eh. I'm so unimpressed, honestly. Uh. Uh. You look really weird. Okay, I don't like any of you. I don't like any of you, frankly. I just, I don't like any of you. Uh, and I can do better than literally every last one of you. Uh, turn to garden, sweetie. Is your brother home with his, his buddy here? Or is he still just like chatting up? You know, he's sort of still just chatting away. How did it take you that long to get through like that one interaction? I guess the game was paused while I was looking at all of those. Come on over, whatever your name is that I've already forgotten. React. Somebody was skinny dipping in the forget. Y'all are some. Oh my god. First there's a lady with fleas. Just getting right up in the pool. And then there's somebody skinny dipping in broad daylight in a public place. Come on. That is uncalled for. That's just rude. Does Sean learn that Simone. Why are we learning? Why are we hearing about this? He earned 46 simoleons in tips. Good job. Where is your little friend? Did he just like not come over even though he was supposed to? Even though he agreed to the proposition of coming over? Well, let's call him up and invite him over again. No, not your family. Where is he? Oh, there he is. There's Mr. Hat. Come over here, guy. She is now gonna go read. How are you? You're pregnant, which of course I know. I hope you have very cute puppies. But how could you not? Actually, something suddenly came up and I can't make it. That's bull. That is bull and you know it. Who are you? Oh my god. I don't know why he's sending me something. Right. Don't play computer games. Your brother needs to, to check. Uh, to check a thing. Why don't you go watch TV, honey? Go watch some TV. Your brother needs to check his online messages. Cause that's what we do. I really do need to just like make a bunch of people and put them in the town for them. You can eat your sandwich in a little bit, honey. And now we have the weird ghost hunter music stuff happening. Oh my goodness me. Never get a break from weird noisy things. Lily just freaked out. Oh yeah, I forgot that she is uh, still skittish. My least favorite pet trait because it's just annoying. Um, let's see. We got a couple of new ones: Darian, Kirby, Alton, and Kane. Uh, no. And see, you can't actually even train them out of it. I don't think. Oh my God, this is gonna drive me crazy. What is this stupid ghost hunter music happening for? Stop it. Catch the friggin' ghost, someone. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Zane each up! How oh, nice! We're gonna invite him over and give him a makeover because he probably looks ridiculous. Because no one ever ages up and doesn't look ridiculous in this industry. That is the way of things. Oh my god, seriously. What is with- Where is this happening and can I reset the entire lot? Is that allowed? Can I just do that? Because it's it's driving me crazy. It's over here. Somewhere. It's literally like, it has to be one of these three houses. Adria, is it your house? Do you have a ghost infestation that's making there be stupid, terrible music? Just to make me lose my friggin' mind. Well, we're gonna reset this this lot and see what happens. Seriously, can't deal with that. Nope. How about this? We'll reset Adria's house. Why? 
why? Why is this a thing? Where is it coming from? Is it you? Alright, so I guess that's just gonna torment me forever. Okay then! I will just slowly lose my mind. I'm going to cut out because I'm about to send them both to bed because they're both sleepy. <laughs> Yay! Alright, we are back. Though it's not bright after I cut out. I actually spent some time, mostly just to get away from the irritating music, um, making some fellas. Uh, putting them in the town, that sort of thing. So we're going to try to get uh, Aiden and Emma introduced to the guys that I put in the town. Whose car is this? Oh, this is your car. It's just not red in that. Um, who I think are, are all pretty, pretty nice fellas. Since the ones that I originally put in, they kind of wandered off and became married and all that sort of thing. So, you know, it happens. At any rate... Let's stop staring at Aiden in his bath. Emma wants to get some food. Are you off today? Yes, you are. So you are going to go on a mission, Emma. You're going on a mission to find those guys. That's what's happening. You're going to find them. You're going to invite them over. And you're going to mingle. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. Um, Probably not going to finish doing that in this episode since we are... Uh, not up on time yet, but probably will be by the time she has a chance to. What, what what are you, Aiden? You really like this outfit, don't you? Put on your other thingy. You're not performing right now. You're not performing. You should have that on. And you're not even working, so you should just actually have your everyday on. Thank you, sir. You don't have, you have ruined your gig. Your gig is today at 6.30, so you need to be, you know, concentrating on that, buddy. Um, and Emma just had an error for no apparent reason. Where are you, Emma? Oh, you're already down here. Well, actually, you're stinky. We're not going to go and visit the guy's stinky, so. That's not going to happen. She's so going to come back upstairs. You're going to wait for your brother to get out of the bathroom. Oops, pay the bills, too. I am so excited. I don't know if you guys have heard, but I am so excited for The Sims 4 and, like, bills in The Sims 4. Wherein, if you do not pay them, you don't get the obnoxious Repo Man randomly taking your crap. Which was stupid and annoying, but they, like, cut off your, your power and, and your water and stuff. Which is amazing, and I love it. And she still has this thing where... Her uh, hair becomes really short in the shower. Is that a weave you have, Emma? Were you hiding that from me? Anyway, uh, these guys live here, but apparently none of them are home. We're going to visit them anyway. We're going to visit them anyway. Aiden, entertain yourself. This is Emma's time. I mean, she'll bring home dudes for you too, but still. She's usually working and you're just kind of lollygagging. I mean, you're going out and you're working. But your job mostly involves being charming and talking to people, so. You know. Little paper girl. I thought I canceled the paper, but whatever. So let's go to these people's house. And she still hates. She's driving a Prius. I feel like with their Prius product placement, Toyota would have insisted that eco-friendly Sims did not get a negative mullet if they were driving a Prius. That just seems like something they would have done. But apparently not. They should hire me. I mean, they shouldn't. I already have a job. and I don't want to work for them. But you know what I mean. I feel like they should have thought of that. Let's visit them. Someone should be home. Oh, come on. How are all four of them gone? Yeah, there's one of them. Blake. I don't know who Christy is. Darren is another one of them. And so is little Virgil here. Oh, and Noah. So they're pretty much all, they're all there. How about you call one of them? Um, call up Virgil. Come on, girl. Stop playing with your phone. We do not have time for this, Emma. Virgil isn't home. Are they literally all tribalic? 
Blake is not home. Where is where are they then? Like they were literally just here like five seconds ago. So let me guess. Literally none of them is home. That's so stupid. Where did they go in like the course of like five seconds? Okay, well, whatever. We're just gonna go somewhere and see what we can see. Um that isn't open until five PM. It's eleven o'clock in the morning. My goodness me, where can we go? We go to this karaoke bar that nobody is ever at. Maybe that's where they went. Girl, 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 stop playing with your phone every five seconds. Oh my god. I mean, let's not pretend that I don't do that too. But come on. Look, I didn't get to A list and Kim Kardashian Hollywood by slacking. <laughs> oh my goodness. Come on, girly girl. This spot looks like the place to be. Oh my god, why do I always go here? I'm going to tear down this lot. Who are you? You're the proprietor. Who are you? You're just some lady whose name won't show up. This spot is the place to be. There's like no one here. Wait, there was one person here. There was Tobin Contreras making faces at himself in the mirror in the bathroom. I would not class that as the place to be, quote unquote. I don't know. Maybe I just have different standards. But I'm not thinking that it's the place to be. But we're going to have a charming introduction to this friggin' weirdo making faces himself in the bathroom. We got invited to somebody's party, but I don't know who it was. Yes, I have not forgotten about Aiden's gig. Oh, she's apparently attracted to this guy. Well. Let's, let's take a look. Let's take a look. Uh, I've seen worse. I've seen worse. It's true. I've seen worse. Um, so let's uh, just uh, chat him up a little bit. I mean, he's kind of a weirdo. Again, he's making faces of himself in the bathroom mirror. But, you know. We can, we can see what's what. Um, yeah, we, you already said that. She has. Oh, she can use flirtatious greets now. She wants to go to five hot spots. What are you doing? Are you getting ready for your show? Wait, it's only one o'clock in the afternoon. You shouldn't be getting ready for your show yet. Yeah, it's not until six thirty. Oh, you're playing with your puppy. Where is Lily? When are you gonna have these puppies, Lily? Should be pretty soon, I would think. Where are you going, honey buns? Why are you going to dig a hole? Go go upstairs and play with a toy. Lily, my darling. My adorable little puppy. The cutest little puppy in the world. So she's getting along well with this guy. Oh. He must be childish. That's why he was like playing in the mirror. Well, I mean, that's fine. That's fine. Sure, she doesn't mind. They're getting along well. It's all good. I still want her to find the other people, but you know. That guy's okay for like a starter dude. Um, see, Aiden, where did you go, honey? Oh, you're going to go play Chase with Milo. Did you make it to the toy box? Yes, you did, Lily. What a good puppy. Oh, she is so cute. Look at her. She's so cute. Oh my god, I can't deal with it. So cute, I'm gonna die. Not really, but you know. Pretty cute. Pretty cute as these things go. I would have you walk Milo somewhere, but like the only dog park is like 800,000 miles away if you try to walk. How about you teach Milo a trick? Uh, teach him to sit up. That's a fun thing for you to do while you're waiting to go do your thingy. She has the allergy haze. <laughs> but whatever, we're gonna dealing with that. Um, so this is still happening. Tell him a joke. I'm sure he'd enjoy that. Probably. Ask him about his alma mater. Hey, here's an important thing. Ask him if he's freaking single. The jerk. I'm already calling him a jerk. I have no idea whether he's single or not. I'm jumping the gun. He might. He might be single. You might be like the one Sam that you didn't, that I didn't put in the town, specifically who's actually single. He went to Starry Community School. Um, they both went there. How oh, nice. 
Look at her. This lady like the bald head getting. Oh, of course he's married. Of course. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye. Every time. Every flipping time. They're always married. They're always married. Um. Okay. So let's go somewhere else, Emma. No, don't, don't, don't start talking to him again. He's married. You, you don't, you don't want no part of that. These guys are all still not here. This is still closed. I kind of want to go to Club Privé, but we can't. Let's go to Black Box. She probably can't get in, but we, we can bribe someone. We can bribe someone to get into Black Box. Um. Oh my God, this lady. She is. Oh, and you're rude too, Tobin. Freaking booing this poor lady who's just having fun singing her little songs. Tobin, you're a jerk, and I'm not upset that you're married. Lily! Lily, why? Why are you doing that? That is so uncalled for, Lily. There are toys up here for you to play with, and you went all the way down there to do that. And we are going to send, wait till Emma gets over here and see if there's anyone here. At Black Box. The club. Oh, you guys, I'm so ready for The Sims 4. I'm not going to lie. I'm so ready for it just because people, people in places. <laughs> That's all I want. Look at her. I had completely forgotten what her uh, formal wear even looks like, but she looks wonderful. Look at her. Looking like a little hot mama. And yes, I know. I know. Okay, and there's nobody here. No, there's like two less people here than there were at the other place. Uh, but we're going to charmingly introduce ourselves to this guy. We're not famous, so he's not going to let us in. So we're just going to bribe him after we charmingly introduce ourselves. Oh, she's attracted to this guy. But no, honey, that's that's not happening. He's not particularly attractive. I, I don't have I don't have high hopes for the children. Yes, thank you for gaining the non-destructive fate, little Miss Lily. Yeah, bribe him, bribe him. Yeah, there we go. Should you just threaten her. Okay, Emma is going to order a drink, a falling forever. Is what it's called. They have a hot tub. And we're actually going to end this part here. So it should be continued. Let's see if anyone ever comes to this very nice club that's been put together. So that Emma can, uh, can I see if, if there's anybody she wants to to hit up. Oh, yeah. You need to do some stuff here. And we, we need him to actually go to his gig. And he's supposed to be himself. Alright! Cliffhanger! I will see you guys in the next thing I make. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Bye-bye!